Alright guys, so today I'm going to be spending the next 100 days as Yuji Itadori in Jujutsu Kaisen Infinite. So yeah guys, get straight into the video. And here we are guys in Jujutsu Infinite's main menu. So it's been a while since I even touched this game. To be honest, I haven't really touched Roblox in a while. But today we're going to be actually trying to become or spending 100 days as Yuji Itadori. I really wanted to make this video as soon as I seen the last episode. Uh, spoiler alert if you haven't watched today. Mahito and Yuji go hand in hand. Basically now, nah, Yuji did destroy Mahito. But we're gonna just jump straight in here. 99 Robux. Have only 32 left. Wow, I am broke. But let's quickly hit buy the new character slot. Let's go here. Let's see how many spins we have. Please. Please tell me we have a good amount of spins because I haven't put any codes in. I haven't played for a while. So I'm hoping to have a good amount of spins to get Sukuna's vessel because that's the innate we're going to be going for today. I also do have a rule regarding the Sukuna spec so uh, so we don't have to spam it basically. Okay, why do I look like Poseidon? Okay, 5,000 spins. Okay, I got a hell of spins. All we need is literally Sukuna's vessel. So let's just start spinning here and hopefully we can get it pretty soon. I do have this which uh, makes it just quick to get anything. As you can see, oh, that's the flames already. Pretty nice. Okay, Judge Man. Okay. Okay, that actually could be okay you know what i'm not gonna spoil anything to do with the manga but but yeah i do have uh like a rule regarding the sukuna vessel because i don't want to actually just like spam the sukuna vessel in their techniques because that'll be basically the same as spending on digit sukuna i'm probably gonna like make it a rule where if i'm low or i'm about to die uh, i can use the sukuna vessel because that's what would happen in the actual anime so it's canon but yeah i'm just start spinning here and hopefully we get sukuna's vessels pretty quick And that's what I like to see, Sukuna's vessel straight off the bat. All it took is like 400 spins. Uh, I was using an auto clicker, that's why I stopped the recording. I was using an auto clicker and just basically just done this basically as you can see. And just stayed still till I got it. But there we go, we got Sukuna's vessel. Perfect. Okay, let me take the auto clicker off. Okay, there we go. So Sakuna's vessel. First thing is, we have to look like Itadori. So let me clearly do that real quick. Looking pretty fresh, I'm not gonna lie. I got Sakuna's vessel. So let's press him to play here. And I'm gonna show you what moves I'm actually going to be rocking today mostly. So if I go over to settings here in the last menu. If I go over to skills, I haven't played this game in a while. We need to get Divergent Fist, Divergent Fist, Second Impact, Black Flash. All these moves, curse techniques, are oh, we need to get like these. We actually need to get innates. We're gonna unlock every single innate move for Sukuna's vessel. We're only gonna use it when we're below like 30% HP. We're only gonna actually start using Sakuna's uh, vessel innate abilities when we're below 30%, 20% HP. Taijutsu moves, we're gonna use a lot of these. We all know Yuji is literally like, bro, he gives hands to everyone, bro. So we're going to be using that especially. We're also also going to be getting to especially great sorcerer today and unlocking uh Sukuna's domain which is gonna be fun to use i can't lie so as you can see we start with a little cutscene. this fits canon right here usually sitting on the train and we get teleported straight to the zen forest okay, i'm pretty sure we're here now all right there we go okay it's gonna take a while for me to actually get the special great sorcerer but let's start off here with the first mission which is let's just quickly do deliver crate i think it's like an easy quest that we can do straight off the bat just to get a, a little bit of xp because we do need a lot more stats so let's go down to the crate do this quest here okay here we are so destination so let's quickly uh, pick this up well deliver it there and there we go we leveled up we got a new skill divergent fist activation which should give us a little bit of like extra m1 damage which is what we like to see so let's really go to skills let's get the first move here we already have it let's get this other move 250 cash this level 30 okay innate we can unlock the first move which is dismantle but we're not really gonna use it at all for the start so let's quickly get these moves rising kick all that good stuff so let's check them out here let's check out divergent fist activation yeah that's what we like to see and then strain the hands we know what rise kick does we know what all these other moves do so yeah that's actually quite good so let's teleport back here let's get straight into here and let's do the quest here let's do defeat 16 cursed uh or scorched curses okay we do have the divergent fist still activated these are gonna be a little bit troublesome i can't lie they do hit kind of hard so let's quickly hit do that okay let's go to stats here what do we really want to do we really want to focus on strength at the start because uh, our M1 damage is gonna be the most important thing here, especially for this. Okay, so let's get to it. Now we're doing eight per hit now, which is not bad. Can't lie, not not too bad. I wanted to get heavenly restriction for this because Yuji seems like he does have. I know he doesn't have heavenly restriction, but like his power, like his physical strength alone, makes it makes you think that he might actually have heavenly restriction. I know he doesn't. Before anyone goes at me in the comments, I know he doesn't. But he rivals the strength of like Maki Toji. So you know, I was gonna get it, but you know what? We're just gonna stick to the OG Sukuna vessel. Let's make our way to the next set of curses here. Six more to kill. I'm hoping I get a pretty good 
decent XP from this. I activated Divergent Fist. We're doing 8.8 .8 damage. So I think it gives you like, what, like 10%? Nah, like 1% actually. It just gives you 1%. Or am I stupid? No, it gives you 10% extra damage. Okay, I'm kind of stupid. Okay, there we go. Let's get this. Boom. There we go. Okay, we've leveled up to level 12 already, which is quite good. Let me show you guys this mantle here if you guys haven't seen it. Because uh, I'm not going to use it much, but I'm just going to show you guys. This is what the mantle is. This mantle is such an OP ability. You don't understand how OP this guy is. So Sakuna's vessel is. But there we go. Okay, so we did all of that. Let's go back now. I want the Ruin Guardian to spawn in quite early. So I'm hoping he does spawn in. But other than that, we should start really doing higher leveled quests. Like, I think we can take this guy on right now. For this fight, I'm going to have to use Sakuna's vessel. So I'm going to have to use this mantle. I can't lie. Or I will get one-shotted. Yeah, I am not killing him. What was I thinking? Yeah, I am not killing this guy. He has so much HP. And we practically do no damage. Okay, yeah, we're not killing him. <laughs> okay, that's unfortunate. So yeah, I'm going to just get back to grinding here. Should I get to like level 50-ish? So I'm going to do a nice little time skip here. Try to get to like level 50-ish or around that mark. And I'm going to be right back as soon as I hit. Okay, so I leveled up to level 49 here and I bought 6 hours of 2 times XP. We're going to be promoting grade here real quick. So let's promote to grade 4. So we do get some, uh, a couple of nice stuff here. So we're going to be equipped in it. So let's equip this and then equip this. Let's see the drip. Ooh, the drip is looking mean. I can't lie. The drip is looking nice. What's the next? Okay, one Heian Relic. Okay, so let's quickly go check if we can actually make that here. Let's check here. Okay, Heian Relic. Okay, we need uh we need some well, more stuff. Okay, we can't get it yet. But we're super close to getting it. We are grid four right now, which is quite good. We can do some harder quests. How do you get cursed flesh? No idea. Maybe it's a drop. Can't remember how to get it. I can't lie. But yeah, let's do this. Uh which one should we do here? Capture point. I think capture on us. Okay, let's do a capture point level 105. Best thing to do right now. I'm probably gonna use my uh innate skill because uh yeah, it's actually quite hard for me to do this without using my innate skills. I've been putting a lot of stats to technique because uh uh, strength isn't really that strong so okay so let's quickly use our dismantle here right there we go okay dismantle done nothing to them oh my god this is gonna be hard to do i can't lie this could be very hard uh dismantle do a couple of m1s yeah this might not even be possible i'm just gonna take a while so let me try complete this here real quick okay so i kind of cheese this with this mantle here i just do this till they all die and i just jump down m1 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 they all die get back and then capture i really really did cheese it but you know what i don't really care we managed to get a good amount of xp from that 62 level 62 respectable respectable not gonna lie so let's put uh six stats here let's put 33 into strength nothing into hp yet let's just stick like this for now let's go do one more quest from grade four okay let's see okay defeat the ruin guardian uh, i want to do that but not now let's do that later let's quickly go kill kill curse user okay we're gonna have to use this mantle here again these quests are way too hard for my level so yeah i won't be able to complete it without this mantle i thought i could even complete it with this mantle the, you know what i could cheese this let's go to skills innate do i have 50 mastery i don't okay i'm not gonna be able to complete this curse i haven't bought any moves yet second impact let's buy that black flash let's get that perfect that's one of the moves that yuji uses a lot we're gonna remove rising kick not useful whatsoever let's use let's put this here this here and black flash here v hi okay let's get to the hands here okay let's just get straight to it m1 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 into this mantle okay caught him bring him down there we go black flash into another m1 combo second impact nice okay that second impact looks kind of clean there we go okay, block that step back from that okay now he did be rocking me for a bit okay this is not good i'm dead come on no i died okay i got him in a good combo but it wasn't here my hp is too low oh, okay that is not good do i have anything that i can put on okay you have nothing oh my yeah we're gonna need to lock in heavy okay i say let's just do Oh, another one of these missions here okay i can't really do any good missions right now which is kind of annoying can't get the xp that i'm looking for but yeah i'm gonna just get back to grinding here and i'm gonna come back when i hit level 100 okay so i finally managed to get some more cursed flesh i think i got four like literally back to back so let's check here okay now i got only three we're gonna craft this and we're gonna move over to the next grade which is great saucer number three i'm probably gonna still carry on doing um the normal grade four quests because uh i'm struggling to even complete any kill cursed user quest i'm too weak i might have to scrap the idea of not being able to use my curse technique that much oh i don't even have enough money oh, i need 30k okay but yeah i can get it so i'm probably just gonna promote without showing you guys but yeah i might actually scrap this idea and start using this a lot more because i'm getting rocked by everyone so yeah it's not really good so i think i will actually just like, start focusing on sukuna's vessel trying to upgrade it as much as i can and i'll probably stop using it when i get to higher levels because early game is gonna be so hard to do anything with just melee and just like curse techniques not the 
innate abilities so that's annoying okay so i'm back here so we're going to be actually promoting grade i feel like i'm strong enough now i just killed the ruin guardian well i didn't kill him by myself a lot of people helped me but we finally got the most broken thing in this game enlightenment beads if i wear it look how much my energy goes up by it like that's why you literally put zero into energy i don't know why these are like super super good like for some reason <laughs> like very very good but we've ranked up to grade three what do we need for grade two let's let's check it real quick grade two okay we need 100k one mission essence and a two hay and relics let's see how many relics we can make real quick here can we make two here one okay we curse flesh and curse log okay uh, mission essence is gonna be a bit annoying to get oh, okay now it's gonna get annoying to start ranking up but we finally uh, got enough mastery due to me killing the rune guardian i managed to get more mastery so we're gonna buy cleave so there we go i'm probably gonna use cleave and dismantle a lot like i can't lie i'm not gonna lie to you guys i need them the, this game is a lot more difficult than i remember so okay see ya let's go here i want to get black flash i'm gonna find a black flash uh nothing so far that i want from here okay we'll sort out the inventory or the stats later on let's do a grade three quest you see how hard they are let's quickly just do okay this shouldn't be too hard it's just one guy that we have to fight and i'm gonna use both cleave and dismantle so we should be good now let's pull him in start the fight off uh, dismantle into a cleave there we go i don't even know if the cleave hit him oh no 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 that's gonna mess me up oh i knew that was gonna mess me up okay let's get into it all right second impact dismantle nope too far oh no i'm dead i'm so dead wow yeah it's gonna be so hot i need more hp bro oh my god yeah i've got rocked by every single cursed person i fought oh that's not good now you know what i'm killing this guy here level 90 i'm going to killing him no chance i'm not even gonna go easy on him i'm just gonna rush him head on make sure he dies come here little boy boom come here dismantle cleave oh i'm using the wrong move block okay let him do his thing dismantle cleave should do hella damage there we go boom my first cursed opponent that i've actually killed second impact there we go okay perfect we killed it okay that is actually pretty good okay so we're looking pretty good right now i'm just gonna keep putting more stats to strength and technique i might put some more into hp because i really do need it i want to start doing the the breaking buildings and stuff because uh i'm gonna use uh cleave for it and cleave makes it so easy to do that it's actually crazy how easy it is let me show you what i mean look how much damage cleave is gonna do boom yeah cleave is so easy to do this i don't know if dismantle connects oh uh, yeah dismantle is not doing much damage or any damage whatsoever second impact boom one new second impact there we go okay yeah so i'm gonna just keep doing that here keep farming up nothing really much to show you guys i don't want to bore you guys with the boring grinding and uh, yeah i'm gonna just focus up try to get to as high level and high grade as possible and i'm gonna be right back as soon as i get to the next grade okay so finally i can go up to the next rank i managed to unlock a new move which is flame arrow which i'm gonna be using right here boom there we go it looks very very clean i can't lie we got cleave also and all that good stuff we're gonna promote grade here okay i need to buy the mission essence hopefully i have enough i'm hoping i have enough money too it's gonna get annoying every time we rank up it's just gonna be worse and worse so let's quickly get the mission essence we need so many other of like these capture and destroy essences uh let's check here can we promote please let me promote there we go grade two what do we need to promote to the next grade oh my god 500k two mission i got the relics already i need the two mission essences and the money the money's gonna be a problem here i can't lie let's i got four of these yes okay can i sell the slaughter demon i think i should have really equipped the slaughter demon because it is a UG move but last time i used it it was bugged so i don't know i'm just gonna use it for now and just see hopefully it's not bugged slash and dice okay i'm pretty sure demon chop is the one that's bugged but let's quickly check here okay i need to focus on i need two right so i need to get eight destroy essences so let me quickly do a destroy quest here real quick the worst things about destroy quests uh i was doing them literally a second ago i can't do them without using uh, my innate skill i have to use cleave uh, i can't actually beat it without using my innate skill because uh, my m1 damage you too little and i die too quickly without using uh, cleave look how much cleave does cleave just does that much like it's instant i also use flame arrow to help me out also do more damage and i get here start hitting the black flashes black flash is 400 to it and it has 20k hp so yeah that's why i'm using cleave uh, let's just keep going here let's activate there we go more damage hit a nice black flash okay a final black flash doesn't work on statues it's a really really good ability but unfortunately it doesn't work on anything but humans or npc enemies okay now it's gonna get tricky a lot of uh, npc enemies are gonna be here so i have to use this mantle straight into a flame arrow okay now we can pick him off yes by himself hopefully we picked him off all right come on 
Uh, let's use double uh, impact or second impact. Cleave should be ready any second. Let's use cleave. Uh, it's literally one more cleave and it should be good. Okay, now three NPCs have spawned in. I have to really, really throw the hands here. Uh, good hands only, please. Uh, dismantle. Come on, hit some of them, please. I just want, need one more cleave. Just one more. Oh my god, I'm on HP. I'm on HP. Okay, I died. Wow, so annoying, man. These quests are so annoying, I can't lie. So hard, but I'm literally like, why is the game so much harder now? Okay, no more destroy missions for me. I am great too now, so I can see what I can do here. Okay, all these are going to be too difficult for me right now. Destroy. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to just get back to grinding. I'm too weak right now to do anything that I want to do. All right, we're finally back, so we're going to be actually promoting grade. I'm pretty sure I have enough. There we go. Promote it to grade one. Now, this is where it's gonna be a pain okay six mission essences six hay and relics one sakuna finger okay i got one sakuna finger luckily so that is good how much would this go for if i said it? oh okay we need to try to find more sakuna fingers man but okay a million's gonna be a problem too i need to buy the final move uh of uh sukuna's vessel i'm not gonna go for the domain if i'm just gonna showcase the domain on my other character slot because domain's gonna take me by itself an extra like four five hours of grinding and what's the point when well, it's like a little thing that I can just show you guys on the, the character the slot but okay i'm just gonna grind up 60 curse user essences 44 I have 44 of these so 12 times 6 that's 70 no that's 72 right yeah okay i need 44 so i have 44 so i need 72 oh it's gonna take a while 4 times 6 that's 24 of these yeah 8 times 6 that's 42 ah uh, that's gonna it's gonna take a while oh my god we're gonna be here grinding so yeah i'm not gonna show you any of this this is too boring i just come back at the end when i'm fighting every boss uh ah wish me luck guys okay i'm finally back after such a long time and oh my god we have made a lot of progress we're basically nearly uh coming to the end of this video here so i managed to get almost a million here i managed to get how many mission essences do we have we have five we need one more and all we have to do is just do one more quest which is uh, destroy essence so let's quickly do that quest this quest i have to use sakuna's vessel because uh without sakuna's vessel i can't really do damage so let's just do an easy grade for one we only need two left oh i should have done a hard one actually so we can get the money we do need like 10k money so i'm hoping we do get like a, a drop here that we can sell but yeah let's quickly uh destroy this here let's just use cleave and then oh i also got a move which is switch here so uh this is the move that basically makes me like into sakuna so there we go it looks really really good i can't lie and it's just so op this move is broken as hell so let's use flame arrow here and like there we go and then this one cleave should do the job right okay no it doesn't okay we need to do 2k damage to it so let's just keep m warning and there we go we destroyed it perfect let's quickly collect all these i'm hoping we get enough cash we literally need 4k more we got this come on come on uh, did i get anything enough to sell oh my i could just sell we need 7k right if i sold 100 of these nah we won't get enough we have to do one more mission that's so annoying oh my god but first let's quickly go buy the final mission essence bro i've been getting super duper unlucky i haven't literally got a single sakuna finger i only got one that i got at the start of the video and i haven't gotten a single one so i'm not gonna go for domain today i'm gonna go for like uh just switch over to my other slot which i do have a domain already which is something that's easy to get so let's just do like a quick mission no let's just do the hardest mission then kill a band of three sorcerers just guarantee that i get enough uh money here but yeah i'm just gonna switch over slots to my other slot where i have sakuna's vessel which is the uh, domain the domain which is malevolent shrine uh there's no point of me grinding it on this slot too it's just gonna be like four hours five hours extra of grind. that's not even actually guaranteed it could be even longer it just depends on uh rng basically but i already made the sakuna 100 days if you do want to check it out i posted it like a couple weeks back so yeah make sure you check that out if you want to see the sakuna version of this all right come on come here oh no okay, i'm getting rocked oh yo i'm actually like really really getting okay i can transform transform let me transform i'm dead okay i died okay that's so annoying if i transformed i probably would have killed them but it's unfortunate this quest is quite hard uh let's do this one now this should be a lot easier uh let's get him here get him into this into arrow and then into cleave there we go get closer to him use second impact boom there we go let's activate get some more damage and let's end this should we end up with a black flash yeah i think we should end up in a black flash so let's grab him and then into a black flash there we go the final black flash boom there we go that is so good and we ended it off perfectly and we managed to get a million holy okay that's actually so good there we go get all these loot drops and it's finally time for us to become special great sorcerers so let's quickly go over to the starting area i guess let's just reset okay so let's quickly go over to uh gojo let's talk to gojo here promote great we got everything that we need promo grade there we go special grades for holy that's uh, that's the final grade you can get to uh, in this game you can't get prism realms so fortunately that's the highest we're gonna get to for today's video but that's basically it now we're gonna have to fight every single boss as itadori so you know what
what I'm going to do. I'm just going to go back to the main menu here. Character slots. This is my Sakuna Vessel slot right here. Slot 3. We're just going to jump straight into it. And then let's just join a private server. Okay, as you can see, I'm already in Tidori here. All right, come on, log me in. All right. As you can see, we do have my leveling shrine, all that good stuff. I'm pretty sure we have Itori's weapon too. Let's check here. Look at that. 42 Sakuna fingers. That's all. If only I had that many. How much is... How much is of these for? Oh, they're only 10 KPs. Okay. Let's just get the slaughter demon out. We have pretty decent moves. I can't lie. So, we don't really get gonna do much anyways. All we, did, all we have to do for now is just literally wait. But let's quickly remove all the vanity so we can look like Itadori. Our skills are pretty much the same. If not better. Can't lie. And let's quickly go over the skills. I want to make sure I have a Divergent Fist activation and Second Impact and the Black Flashes. So, let's take up till out of here. First of all, let's actually equip these. So, purchase this. Second Impact impact all right let's equip these here so activation put it here put black flash iv final black flash here and then we put domain or simple domain at g uh that should be enough here okay now all we have to do is just wait for all bosses to spawn in so i'm gonna just afk here till all bosses spawn in and uh, we're gonna be doing domain clashes fighting every boss it's gonna be fun guys okay so the bosses should have spawned in by now right okay so the rock cardinal and the volcano deity have spawned in so let's quickly go over to the volcano deity here there we go volcano deity let's quickly uh teleport there there's no point doing the ruin guardian he is so weak he'll probably get two shot by me i i'm not gonna use sukuna's vessel straight off the bat i'm gonna use it for rock cardinal but for this one i'm gonna try hold up for uh using it for a bit until i'm like 5k hp when i get to 5k hp i'm gonna switch and then I start using the moves but this could be actually a quite hard fight because this guy is kind of strong so let's make our way there all right here we are let's pull him in there we go let's hit him with the final black flash straight off the bat we're only gonna use our normal m1 moves so quickly activate one divergent activation there we go hit him with the second impact okay good nice one nice one okay step back pull him in there we go hit him with a black flash come on you should know yuji and his black flashes at this point all right let's switch out to this get close to him there we go m1 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 get close to him like that cut him again let's use the x oh i don't even have mastery on this account that's unfortunate all right let's get close in let's do second impact there we go all right, all right let's m1 there we go predicted the m1 of mine he's literally destroying me there we go let's slice him up slice and dice pull him in okay hit a black flash there we go yuji is doing his thing bro second impact we didn't even need to do anything oh my god we absolutely destroyed him holy that was so easy second hardest boss in the game and he just got whooped by itadori oh that's actually so good oh legendary drop okay i haven't seen a single special grid drop since i started playing i don't know if they removed special grid drops but we're gonna find out because we haven't fought the rock cardinal yet he's the one that's supposed to be dropping all the good stuff so yeah let's quickly go actually you know what the rune guardian just spawned in we might as well do him too so let's quickly go fight him all right we're teleporting straight to him let's just get to the hand straight away all right come here okay he's actually kind of rocking me all right we do play this kind of scared a little bit at the start like pull him in there we go second impact okay i don't have all my moves which is quite annoying let's hit a slice okay no 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 all right demon chop there we go that's what i'm talking about nice itidori you got the hands and i sit with a black flash there we go nice okay hey i think get out of this get close to him hit a slice and dice there we go let's end it off with a final black flash here or try to at least oh i killed him by accident never mind okay so sakuna's vessel no sort of demon okay let's get these rewards give me a rune shard i don't know why i did a rune shard but might as well give me one okay nothing from this guy so far okay nothing okay now we're moving over to the hardest boss in the game the rock cardinal he is actually quite troublesome so i will be using sakuna's vessel to carry me through this because yeah that guy does have malevolent shrine too so we need to counter that we're probably gonna do a domain clash with this one so let's make all the way down what cardinal special grade 4 quest let's make our way there all right oh, i don't know how we're gonna do this all right let's just get in straight away hit a dismantle there we go push him back flame arrow okay cleave nice okay let's get in there hit him with a black flash there we go perfect 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 okay everything's going well so far boom okay i need to get close m1 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 second impact nice okay oh no i right, grab him no 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 okay if that if that hit me would have been troublesome no 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 okay don't use that move there's one move that he uses which would probably one shot me okay let's hold this yes nice counter that hit him with the cleave okay good 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 let's hit him with this okay we just need to counter oh no okay that would one shot me okay he didn't hit me perfect we're good we're good oh my god he did hit me okay use your domain dismantle all right he should be using his domain we can kill him but i want to do a domain clash use your domain bro okay you know what should we just use our domain i think we might die if we don't use it so we're just gonna use it here all right there we go got him in our domain expansion let's do this oh this looks so clean oh my god domain expansion malevolent shrine oh my okay and we're gonna switch straight away that's he's gonna die from the from the cuts but 
there we go we killed the final boss in this game very very easy no death we could have killed him without a domain but that was actually quite fun to use a domain and we transformed Sukuna. now he's gonna go on a massive rampage <laughs> there we go our domain disappeared let's collect all the rewards i'm actually really interested to see what we're gonna get okay mid for the first drop mid for the second drop something good come on go. let's drop oh one, one suck in the finger oh that's good but why is it one especially good drops were like five by a time oh, there we go and finally okay the one more chest there is one more and there we go we're done but yeah guys that's going to be it for today's video i hope you enjoyed it make sure you smash like subscribe button let me know in the comments down below which other character in jjk i should spend the 100 days as and next time i'll catch you all next time peace out